Hey guys, I'm Tara. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do an at-home total ab workout so you don't need any equipment. If you are new here, please hit that subscribe button below. If you guys would like to use this workout and kind of like combo it with other workouts to do like a total body workout, I have an upper body and a lower body workout that I can link in the comments below. Okay guys, so we're going to do a quick standing warm up and then we'll get down on the mat to do our ab exercises. So we are warming up the core, so what I want you to do is you're going to lift one leg in toward your chest and then slowly lower down. Lift one leg, top it in like you're aiming toward the chest and then lower down. So use your abs to pull the leg up and in, switching on and off. You can go as high as you want. Don't go super high and start like crunching in here. So only go as high as you can keep your back flat and straight. Lifting in, lower down. Okay, so you're really using the abs to move the leg. So it's slow and controlled. Do one more on each side. It's also a balance exercise. Come back to center and just reach across, on and off. So just twisting a little bit. Feeling the abs work as you twist side to side. One more each side. Okay, come back to center. We're gonna do like standing oblique twists. So you're gonna have your hands behind your head, you're gonna lift your leg up, and you're aiming your elbow for that knee. Same thing, we're not crunching right now, so even if you, if you lift here and you have to crunch down, then just do a little less of range. Okay, so on and off here. side. Okay, so that was our warm-up, so we'll get down onto our mat for the next exercise. So for our first exercise, we're going to lay on our back, and we're going to do like a double leg push-out. So you can keep your hands kind of like underneath your butt, and you're going to push the legs out, and then back in. Push the legs out, and back in. Okay. Only coming in to about 90 degrees, we're not coming all the way back in. Keep going. Make sure you're pulling the abs down and in. So a slight space in your lower back is good to keep you in neutral spine, but if you feel like you're really arching to lower, then instead of coming so low, you can just go a little higher and push out this way. Okay, so you have options. Let's do 10 more. Okay, you got five left after this. Keep your upper body relaxed on the mat. So next we're going to do one leg drop and kind of like a oblique twist. So you're going to have your legs up. So we'll stage one. You can just drop one leg and lift up from here. Okay? Keeping the abs pulling down and in. If you want a little more of a challenge, you're going to lift up into a crunch. Okay? Not much, just the shoulders lift up. And as you drop one leg, you're going to reach over the opposite leg. Okay, so if the left leg drops, the left arm is reaching over the right leg, and then back up. Okay, choose what variation works for you. I already feel my abs. We're in the beginning of the workout. Let's 
do five more on each side. exercise. Stage one, you have the legs down, you're going to lift up and you're going to side bend. So you're trying to reach toward one ankle, then the other. Okay? If you want more of a challenge, then you're going to bring your leg up into tabletop and you're twisting here. Ten more on each side. <laughs> One more. Okay. Whew. Relax the legs down, and then you're gonna sit up. And we're going to go on to all fours. Okay. All right, so on all fours, you're going to pull the abs up and in, tuck your toes underneath you, lift your knees, hold. And lower down. So we're lifting on and off, so just the knees lift a little bit, so they're like lifting an inch off the floor. Hold it, hold it, and lower. Five more. Lift and hold, hold, and lower. Lift, hold, and lower. Three more. Lift and hold. Pull the abs in. Make sure you're breathing. Lower, lift, hold it, lower, lift, last one, let's hold a little longer, hold it, and lower, okay, okay, so next exercise we're moving into a plank. Okay, this is going to be our last exercise, and we'll have different variations that we can do with this. So I'm going to go on my forearms. So stage one of a plank is a modified plank, so you're on your knees and you're holding here, okay? If that's too easy, you're going to come up onto your toes and hold your plank here. If you want even more of a challenge, you're going to lift one leg and then the other, but you're only lifting a little bit, okay? You're not lifting super high. So choose your variation, and let's go. Okay, I'm gonna do the lifts. Keep holding, or lifting. Keep going, halfway there. Okay, almost there. Okay, and lower down. Go ahead and sit up. Okay, so let's lay down. Just do a little pull down and stretch. So go ahead and just windshield wiper the legs side to side. Okay. And we're just going to do a couple bridges. So you're going to lift the arms up as you lift your hips. And 
lower the arms, lower back down. Lift the hips, lift the arms, and lower back down. Two more like that. Lift and lower. One more. Lift and lower. Okay, let's just do a stretch. So turn on your stomach. Prop up on your elbows. Bring your shoulders down and back and just stretch through the abdomen. Take a few breaths here. Sit up. So that is your ab workout for today. If you guys have any video requests on workouts that you want to see in the future, go ahead and let me know in the comments below. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please again hit that subscribe button. Thanks guys. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.